Okay, well guys, um, as you can see, I I just did a, a seven piston extender. That's too high. Um, if you just want to check there, it's too high. Um, then see it extending. There you go. Then retracting. And there you go. Okay. So yeah, it's pretty pretty cool. I reckon. Like it's a. I mean, it's like a seven piston extender. Who who wouldn't want a seven piston extender? <laughs> um, yeah, it's it's really um really compact. Um, I don't know like if anyone's beat it, but uh, comment in the comment section below. Um, uh, to, just to say if like anyone's made a smaller one um, than me. Uh, but this one is um, that's four and five there, and that's four there. So um, uh, that would be seventeen by seven, I think. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, seven. Um, 17 by 8 by 2, which is pretty, like, compact. Um, but anyways, uh, uh, back with the tutorial. So, obviously, the input. Um, it's a standard input that I use in, like, pretty much every extender. And then the uh, extension is the standard extension that I use in most things. Um, so, yeah, just put, like, uh, two tick repeaters in these, um, gaps right here with the blocks. And then, um, like this, two tick, and then this is going to be four tick, this one here. Um, so it's in line with the block on the 7th extender. Um, and then you're gonna want to do this like that um, then like this and then that should be the extension um, and the first two distance uh, retraction um, so there you go and then now you want to get a half a dropper uh, falling edge minus able so get the um, hopper wherever it is. It's not in there. Um, then the obviously the comparator coming out with a repeater in front on two ticks. I mean four ticks right there. Um, the four ticks is just a timing issue really um, for the other like. Uh, for the other retractions uh, but it works with like two ticks there but like later on um, it won't work so that's like just a little problem that I came across um, and then you are yeah as you can see I'm just making this little platform right here um, like this and then like up to there with like that and then like this with that and that okay so now there are repeaters um, this one on two ticks four ticks two ticks four ticks four ticks two ticks um, and then two ticks four ticks and then four ticks, two ticks. Um, yeah, as you can see, the delay bit here, like here, is um, uh, it's like a pattern that I came across when I did like a, uh, just a, a like 
a normal six piston extender. Um, but it's pr a pretty cool one. And also, don't forget to put an item in the dropper um, for the comparator to take a signal out of. And as you can see, that's the first bit there. And I might, um, during this tutorial, hop over and back um, in between uh, this one and then that one um, for like delays and ish, like where to put stuff. But um, for the this bit, I know. Um, so that's a four tick repeater there um, with a comparator coming going into a torch out of that dropper, um, and then a, another four tick in front of it with a block up and then a block there with a three tick repeater there. And if we test that. That should be the second bit, like that. Um, then get a dust right there, four ticks here, and then you are wanna, gonna do this with three ticks there, um, another three ticks. Um, I'm just gonna check something. All right, cool. Um, yeah, so three repeaters there, one on four ticks, and then another two on three ticks there. And then uh, bring a line up here, three ticks, three ticks, and then another three ticks, um, like that. And then if we test that, that should be the third bit of the refraction done, like that. But now we're getting into the long little line here for the final retraction so get a repeater coming from there um uh, wait okay uh coming into a another repeater on three ticks into a block and then a block there with a repeater on three ticks once again block up and then another block like that, three ticks, all the way until this um, block here with that dust on the top. Um, so three ticks, and then just, if you want to build a platform for it to be on, um, three ticks, oops, three ticks, three ticks, and then another three ticks, and then that should be it, unless I've forgotten something. Okay, um, so that's that's how to make the two high seven piston extender. Um, it's quite a an achievement. Um, yeah, and I, I tried to work on like an eight piston extender the other day, but it didn't really work, and I couldn't get um, the timings to match up and stuff and blah blah blah. blah. But yeah. Um, let me know in the comment section if you have done an 8 piston extender and I might even put a link in the description to that video if you made a video on it and if not then just I'll put your name in the description <laughs> and um, that you made it um, so thanks for watching rate comment and subscribe and peace